Well, I'm back here again. I've got everything uh, unwrapped. I got the paint on the tips of the tail fins there and the rockets in yellow. I've got everything sealed in future. I've got the uh, pilot figure painted up. Got some rubber black on the tires and some white on the landing gear. And that's about it. And now it's time to uh, attach the deck holes. That's usually a pretty long job. There's so many small uh, deck holes, but I'm hoping it'll go quickly. Okay, here I am back again. I've got the decals on, and uh, it's probably a good thing to put the decals on before putting the landing gear on, especially because there's one that goes right over where they attach, so that wouldn't work if you had to uh, if you had the landing gear in place first. So I put uh, all the decals on. Um, not too many problems. Um, I did. I don't like doing the the decals on the on the wingtips or on these. Uh, the tips of these uh, tail tail fins. Um, so I painted, as you saw in a previous episode, I painted the tops here and I painted the rockets. I didn't realize these were yellow too. I would have painted those. Uh, otherwise I had to put a decal on the top, a decal on the bottom on each side. And then it's, it's I guess I could touch that up with some yellow paint on the tips there. Those are a real pain to get in place and to stay in. And I would have painted those uh, if I could, if I had thought of it. It comes with numbers 1 to 7. I chose number 7 for that. Um, so I've got all these ready to go now. I'm going to uh, put everything in place and then uh, seal it up with some future. And uh, it'll be done. So stay tuned for the uh, finished product. Well, the assembly went quite well. I just had to attach the landing gear and wheels, pop the pilot in place and uh, put the canopy on. So that all went together quite well. I took a little bit of yellow paint and just dabbed it on the ends of the uh, wing tips here. And there's decals, as I mentioned before, on the top. So I just uh, closed it in the sides there with uh, some yellow paint. A little bit of gunmetal on the back here with a black wash inside for the uh, exhausts. And it came out really nice. I'm uh, really pleased with it. Nice looking little egg plane. Thanks very much, Oren, for sending that to me. So I have this one uh, in for the group build this year, another one on the shelf. And thanks to Charlie Mack and Daniel, the Munchkin Modeling Man 72, for hosting the eggplant group build again this April, this year. And uh, yeah, it, these are fun little kits. I've got a few of them now. And, and uh, again, thanks to Oren for uh, keeping my streak going. I didn't miss the year for the eggplant and I uh, appreciate that a lot. So stay tuned and uh, see what's going to be up next.